it today, like there's about 100 people behind me probably using free Wi-Fi, but I don't blame them. Why not? Why not? Why not take advantage of the free Wi-Fi in town? Oh shit, I'm pouring my drink all over. I'm a bit, I'm a bit waved, I'm not going to lie. So I don't really drink and it's literally got to me. But yeah. Be out live again in Bradford. Enjoying the random beefs, the random arguments. Why not? I need to find me a zoo. I've lost me. Oh, there we go. I docked a spliff out um, a zoo out earlier. I, can't, I don't know if I can say spliff on YouTube, but yeah. Yeah, I can. It's spliff, spliff, spliff. It's all good. It's all good. Why not? There's a guy doing some trick in a wheelchair behind me. I don't know who he is, but he's going backwards. Doing some tricks. Wheelchair hawks right there, mate. my camera because I don't know if that people so I'm gonna try I'm gonna try avoid smoking on camera because it's not good don't smoke man don't smoke well I don't smoke cigarettes I smoke the green that's about it but still I still don't think that's good for you because drinking and zooting at the same time is not good for you I can't fucking light it much There we go. I've got a shit lighter. It's a bit windy. But I hope everybody's having a good Saturday night anyway because I'm just enjoying having a chill on my ones. So why not? You alright, mate? You're good chilling. Night, yeah. yeah, I had a good night, mate. Mash. What time? Uh, what the football score was that? Bradford, I think the one, two, one was. Are you sure? Because I got told it one, one. Oh, one, one. Oh, damn. Somebody told me it was two, one. I don't. I only got support Arsenal, me, but yeah, you know. If it had been, if it had been two, one, I'd have won the game. Oh. And because they scored in the ninety-third minute, you know, you know, they didn't play yeah, over yeah. nine minutes. Though. A good game, though, yeah. No, no, no. no. Struffy, struffy. It needed mm. a goal going off someone's backside, you know what I mean? There were no engine away, there were no short passes, triangles, you know, like you see with Man City and that. Yeah, yeah. There were none of that. I hope to see Bradford back in Premiership one day, man, because they've got a big big stadium to still be in League Two. That stadium's bigger than Luton, Luton Stadium, bro. Have you seen the capacity, didn't it? What, what capacity? Uh, 22,000. Wow. So, a second degree match. For, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Bradford, they're doing numbers, bro. They just need to, they need to get, they need to get up into the Premier League, bro. Yeah. Well, my one and only season in Premier League, only yeah. show talent in the seven and eight years. I never saw the fucking match except for. Ah, oh, yeah. Except for match there. I, I lived there for ten years. But this is my town. Oh, born here, bred here, man. Yeah. I got where I went when I was there for ten years. And, uh, nah, I got nice. Nice. I get you, man. Love it, man. Everybody's partying. They're listening to the wrong tunes, or they need to be listening to Ambler Productions, innit? He's a proper. Oh, who's Ambler Productions? Is proper good house, no house music and grime music. Drill. Oh, drill. Grime is like drill. Have you ever heard of Skepta? Yeah, like, yeah. Come on, Skepta. Yeah, man. But they're like six years old. What you say, bro? No, take it easy, man. Take it easy, man. Respect. Oh, yeah. shit. Is that a dog loose? I shit myself in. Oh, I'm scared of dogs. I'm getting the hell over here, mush. What you say? I don't smoke spice, bro. I only, Sorry, I only smoke weed, bro. I <laughs> Strictly weed, bro. I don't even smoke cigs, bro. It's weed. Some guy asking me if I smoke spice, man. Crazy. I think he's spiced out. I didn't even know that were a thing these days. Spice. Yeah, I'm all right. I think. 
yeah man I think he's out of his head he just asked if I just told me he can get me some spice or you pay Sado you pay Slavers I'll let you know if I see you wrong because I literally spent my money today bro yeah. but yeah yeah man take it easy lads yeah yeah it's all good. see around bro my days that dog is so scary look, look at this dog this dog is massive it's a big dog yeah. holy shit i'm definitely getting away from that dog much i'm getting away from this dog because it's fucking gonna take my legs off or something jesus it's a big dog as well. A very big dog. I don't even know what dog it is, but Jesus. I like dogs though. But I'm scared of some dogs. <laughs> Holy shit. Right, let me show you this dog again because it's fucking massive. Let me zoom in. It's absolutely massive. That on all fours, mate. Literally. I don't, there's nowhere to run either, so he's gonna probably catch somebody. There's a little dog over there, so I reckon it would have tried to kill the little dog first. But you should have muzzles on dogs. I like dogs. I like all dogs, man, but even with my own dog, I won't ever like walk near anybody near like anybody. But what's people saying? What's my one viewer? Tell me where you're from. Let me know. Part of the world are you from? Are you from the UK? But yeah, the only th good thing about Bradford, yeah, is the takeaways, yeah. The food is banging, yeah, but everything else is just mad. Very crazy. But Bradford is always kicking like every day. Literally. What's everybody saying, man? Somebody want to jump on um, guest? I want a video to video somebody, but nobody nobody wants to jump on. Waiting for guest. Come on. Somebody come on. That's all it says, waiting for guest. Everybody's scared to jump on. Just talk to me, man. <laughs> Let me know what music you like. I prefer verbal communication. But yeah. Very stoned. A guy asked me about two minutes ago if I smoked spice. He said he could get me some some spice. I'm like, yo, what the fuck? I don't smoke spice, bro. First time I've drunk in like so many years, yeah. And I'm waving all over. Does a guy think I'm smoking spice? Did you not smell the chronic startup? Definitely couldn't. But yeah. Everybody's waved. Everybody literally. It's not Bradford Town, it's Zombie Town. Everybody's zombie. But I always get wary, yeah, because the amount of times I've ended up in fights, yeah, with some random schizophrenic swinging punches at you when you're just walking by. Don't worry, I'll come out on top the last time, but it'll be scary if a big massive hench guy like comes at you, man. What are you gonna do then? I'm not even that big. What are you gonna do then? But um, I'm very waved because you shouldn't smoke weed, yeah, and uh, drink at the same time because it's fucked you up. The main thing, I need a piss, yeah, and I don't want to piss outside because I know I'm going to get fine. Somebody's like ranting on. Somebody's ranting much. You can hear that in the background. I don't want to put camera on him because people are wary with cameras on him. Somebody's got some explaining to do. That's all I can hear. The ginger goose. The ginger goose. I don't know what that is, but yeah. It's 
from what they said. I really do not know. Let me look in the live chat. Has anybody popped up? Let me know where you're from. Please let me know. Everywhere is kicking, like literally everywhere. I think this is where all the old people come and rave. There's always seems to be old people in there. Playing like Elvis and stuff. Everybody in that club must be at least minimum 60 year old. But at least they're still out raving, enjoying the life, that's the main thing. Because I'd be the same. Like, if you think about it, yeah, that, that generation are still listening to Elvis, yeah, so when we're about 60 or whatnot, we'll still be listening to, like, what music we list, listen to in the past, if you know what I mean. So, yeah, the cycle will never die with music. But I think music's at a peak now because all music, yeah, there's not much you can do with music these days because eventually it's all going to sound the same. You get me? That's why you just got to try to stay unique as possible. Definitely waved. Like, really waved. Just walking around in a circle. I got some guy over there just keeps staring at me because he probably thinks, what's this guy doing just walking around waved? But what's he doing looking at me? That, that's the thing. But yeah, I think I'm just going to blaze me up a spliff now. I've had too much to drink. I've only had a few shots here, but I'm a lightweight. I won't lie. I had uh, some whiskey and coke. Not cocaine. I don't do that. None of that stuff. Strictly ganja. Straight up. Now 10 past 9 and the uh, town's still kicking. I was here last night at about 3 o'clock in the morning and there was so much stuff kicking off that I literally had to delete my live stream because in the background there was a fight and I don't think you can have any kind of violence on this platform because it's not good for your channel. But yeah, sometimes you can't help if you're live streaming and beef kicks off in the background so you literally you just can't help it because you're in a public area. I'm really in need of a piss. Um, yes, Rick's, what was it, Rick's, uh, Rick's mates. Yes, big ups, bro. How are you doing? What are you saying? What are you saying, bro? What music you feeling lately? Are you, I've got uh, Grime fans and House fans. So I'm just curious to, I'm just wondering, are you, do you uh, come to my channel for Grime or House music? Because I'm a literally, I'm literally, that's all I'm going to make these days is house and grind. But house has kind of saved my channel because my channel was in the mud for ages. There's not many people were viewing grime lately. Like, grime is not dying, but not many people view it these days. So I needed something else to make. And a lot of people always suggested house because where I'm from, Bradford, house music is big. And it's kind of helped me in a way. I worked with a guy called uh, Forbert and RP Ops. And uh, literally, um, this is on my house music as well. They've literally got uh, this, they blew up on, on the first track they did together. So it's mad. And if you know if you, if you know about Bradford MCs, don't watch Bad Boy Chili Crew. Check Forby out, bro. Forby's a good MC. Yeah, big up, bro. I'm a bit waved right now. I bro, have I just got a donation? Bro, you didn't have to do that, seriously. But yeah, mad respect. I've just got a donation of £10, bro. Like, literally, that's mad. Mad respect, bro. I use your grime track shoes. Yes, bro. Mad respect. I'm going to make some... Do you know what it is? I've got loads of grime beats in progress at the moment. So, this week, I'm going to drop some house music, uh, no, some grime music, sorry. 
I've got a lot of house music in progress too. But yeah, mad respect for that, bro. Honest man, proper, proper legend, bro. Oh, look at this big dog here. That dog's huge, mate. Nah, mad respect, bro. Like honest, big up. Let me just watch your channel called. Everybody subscribe to Rick's Mace if you come across this stream somehow. Because my man's a G because literally you didn't have to do that bro, but that's just made my day because Yeah man, like man just donated a tenner to me. Big up bro. I have almost done a been the mega cheapy song to one of your no I yeah. Let me read that I my chat thing's a bit uh laggy. I have almost done a bin the chippy mega chippy song to one of your doors, but I smashed my teeth in and cut rap until the 19th. Ah, uh, damn, bro. Bro, you know what's mad? I literally, I've got a fake tooth there. Eh? About three months ago, Um, I ended up in a fight with some random dude, some random guy, he sucker punched me. And the thing is, it was just a big, like, seven foot tall skinny guy, but uh, he just randomly sucker punched me. My tooth were kind of already wobbly, so he just knocked it out, and yeah, I didn't know till after the fight, but um, they had knocked my tooth out, it's not good, it, my front tooth as well, so if I, when I take this flipper thing out, yeah, I look like a hillbilly, so it's mad, but yeah man, I look forward to hearing your mood, just let me know bro, just message me on Instagram, and uh, I'm always blessed to check music especially when it's on my beats bro like that's mad mad respect bro for even using the beats for tuning in as well because without people like you i probably wouldn't have motivation bro i'm walking around with a mask i look like all right cracking now nah, bro i felt like that yeah but uh you know online uh you can get these uh things online as well I've been using them before I got this flipper tooth thing. But uh, what, what the water looks realistic as well. Um, what were they called now? Um, I forgot what they were called. Uh, yeah, medical tooth kit. A medical tooth kit, yeah. And uh, you literally put it in some boiling water and it And uh, you went in. Yeah. Oh, bro, nah, nah, bro, you didn't have to do that. I wish I could literally refund you because you didn't have to do that. Man, just give me 20 bar, bro. Bro, I'm mad respect for that, bro. Honest. But yeah, get the, uh, I forgot what you know. It's just called a tooth repair kit. They basically come in a weed bag, yeah? Looks like little uh, plastic pebble things. You put them in hot water and then you can mold the tooth on it. And honest, yeah, I was using them for about, for about, uh, about five months. Before I got my tooth sorted, and uh, yeah, it made me feel because I was wearing a mask as well, like constantly wearing. Gums away, man. I been blazing hard. My mouth is yeah, bro. I feel you, bro. My mouth fucked as well. I get you, bro. Smoking like when you lose your teeth as well, it makes it worse, doesn't it? But yeah, my teeth are all fucked as well. Like my fang tooth there, that's fucked as well. And uh, all my back teeth from smoking. Is... So yeah, hopefully one day I can get them all sorted. Hopefully. But uh, yeah, man, mad respect for that, bro. Honest. Get the rickety, rickety, then come out. Yeah, man. Yes, Rory Fleming, big ups. Big ups both of you, man. Ambler, what's cracking? I'm just in town, bro. Like, literally, uh, randomly streaming. I don't know if my phone's going to die. Let me just put me, uh, I've got a charger pack on me somewhere. There we go. This little brick. So I'm going to put it in my phone. There we go. I think we are good now. There we go, it's charging. Yeah, big up both of you, man. I'm doing that IRL content. Yeah, why not, man? I like, you know what it is, bro? I used to be scared to, like, talk to you know, people. I've got, like, uh, I don't know what you call it. Like, like you get, like, not nervous, but I never used to be like that. I think I just blazed too much. And I just didn't associate with people for so many years. 
it's making beats and beats. You just forget to associate with people. Island getting cold, my God. Yeah, it's kind of chilly today, you know. Yeah, anxiety, like stuff like that. So I think if I talk to people, it'll help me more, if you know what I mean. Like, I always thought in my head I want to do, uh, like, content, like, talking to people, like, people on my channel. Especially, like, because uh, it lets me know what music you want me to make or whatever. Like, any suggestions of uh, any type beats you want me to make, just let me know, man, because I need some ideas, you know. Ideas are good. But, yeah, man, mad respect for the donation as well. Rick's Mace. Yeah, man. Mad respect, bro. I swear I'm dying for a piss so bad, but I don't want to get a fine. The last time I had a piss outside, um, I think there were some cameras around town and police came up to me and they said, oh, we've just seen you on camera taking a piss, blah, 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 and I got a fine. So ever since I've been paranoid since. So I might have to go into McDonald's for a piss. But yeah, like... I suppose if I talk on stream to people, yeah, because me personally, I don't chill with many people. Like, literally, I mainly chill with one of my mates from back in the day and I just smoke, like, joints with him sometimes on a weekend. But apart from that, I just rather just make beats, put my head down, because everybody, back in the day, they were snakes off. They were thieves. I had mates, yeah, they'd just, like, you'd have stuff that would go missing from your house and shit, man. It was just like, you know what? Are these people stealing or whatever? So I just, like... I just like went my own path, if you know what I mean, but better like that. I use IRL to get stuff on my chest, to get stuff off my chest. Yeah, that's what it is, bro. Like, it's good because you get to speak, you speak to people like, uh, people, I prefer to sp speak to people that I don't know, yeah, than people that know me. Because a lot of people are just judgmental about everything. Like, obviously, like, sometimes I do get some trolls, so I don't care about trolls, but when you get real people like you, like, obviously, you just, you just like get down to work with them, if you know what I mean. Like probably if you did a live stream, like you'd probably feel more like, I don't know. You feel, you just feel, you feel like you're communicating more. It's like you can tell I don't talk much because Jesus hell, I stumble a lot on my words and everything. So I need to communicate with people a lot. It doesn't help that I'm stoned and a bit uh, drunk. Is UK getting bad now with fights and stuff? Yeah, I was streaming the other day and uh, in town last night and they were fighting in the background and I had to delete my stream because I was paranoid that um, YouTube will give me a strike or something. I get all because of IRL too. I've been um, dot fully they come into my chat with my family members and names I'm picked. Yeah, fuck the trolls, bro. You know what it is? Trolls, yeah? They're just giving you, they're giving you views. They ain't got no let, better to do with their life. If they feel like they have to target you, then, like, they're giving you views, bro. And, like, I used to think, like, oh, if I ever get any trolls and all that, I don't know how I'm going to react. But then over time, you just literally, like, yo, these people are just trolls on the internet. And, uh, Half of them are on, like, unknown accounts where you never even know who they are and stuff. So, you know, like, that's what they're doing a rig. I bet most of their, like, communication on the internet is just, like, shitting on people, basically. Loads of stalkers on here, man. Yeah, definitely, bro. Like, people, like, what probably... You know what it is? It's probably people who you know who know you. That's what I think, like, when I get, like, haters, random haters or, like, random accounts, like, trolling me on Facebook. Instagram, YouTube, and I'm thinking, yo, these people are definitely crazy. They go out of their time and way to fucking target you as a person. Yeah, man, fuck them, bro. They're just waste, man. Like, right, the proper waste, man. Yeah, I'm surprised the fighting kicking off now. This is usually where, like, the nightclubs are all the way up the street, and usually there's fights constantly.
I've never needed a slash in my life more than this ever. I swear. Like, literally, I don't know where to have a piss. But I'm, I'm waved. I'm definitely waved. Do you know when you drink, yeah, and you don't feel like you don't feel like it's getting to you, then like it just keeps creeping and creeping up on you. That's what I feel like right now. Go to the bookies toilet. I've had loads of YouTube drama there, never leave, but yeah, I see you on here on everyday sink all the time. Yeah, bro. You know what it is? There's just too many trolls, bro. Oh yes, bro. Chippy. I don't I thought I recognised you, bro. I've seen you around the town in it a few times. Man. Don't mind me, I'm a bit storm, bro. I'm just streaming on YouTube, man. But yeah, man, top man, bro. Yeah, the local Bradford MC, man, is sick. MC Chippy, you should check him out, man. But yeah, trolls, bro. Too many trolls, yeah, like... You know, the more you get known, the more trolls you get, bro. But yeah, then people, I I used to think of, like, I used to... When I was younger, you... Shitting all day, so then people fifty percent fights would put you off going out in, in town. Yeah, that's what it is, bro. That, that's why uh, I probably never go out really. I'm not even out clubbing, bro. I'm literally just in town walking around. I see, usually see a lot of people when I so I just go for a walk, smoke a zoo. But uh, yeah, every, every time I've ever gone clubbing when I was younger, there's always been fights or there's always some dickhead who wants to start a fight. But, yeah, fuck them. They're all dickheads. Then people won't go out looking for fights when they match. Like me, I'm pissed now, but I don't feel like I want to fight anybody. I'm stoned as well. I don't want to fight anybody. But I think them people are just on cocaine and they're all on multiple drugs. So their heads are a bit fucked. So they want to fight everybody and just... Yeah, they just want to be a dickhead. I got one puff. Yeah, no, I got one PS, them faces. One minute, uh, I got. I got one of them PF, them faces people want to start on. Bro, I always feel that, you know, the amount of times I've been randomly just walking around, someone nudges into me or someone just stares me out. And I'm thinking, yo, I'm just trying to mind my own business. And yeah, people like that, bro, they're probably. I always think they're sus. I'm not against like uh, people what swing the other way, yeah, but I always think for another man to. Look at another man, like, what always wants to fight another man for no reason. Yeah, then people have got issues, or the driver, the driver got psychosis, whatever it's called, schizophrenic, 100%. The drama gets worse every day, to be honest, now. Yeah, facts, bro. Especially, you know, these uh, youngsters as well. I've had little, like, uh, teeny boppers bump into me and wanting to start a fight and stuff. I had a, uh, the amount of times I've nearly got into fights with youngsters is crazy, bro. Like, proper crazy. Like, they'll be swinging bats at you and, like, you think you don't want to hit him because of the kid. You've got no choice because you don't want somebody swinging up on you. And kids, when you're 16, they're about the same size as you, but you just know they're young because they've got no pubes on their hair or anything, yeah. But, yeah. It's because we're too pleasant and they smell fear, but they get a shock. Yeah, that's 100%. Because they don't think you're going to react. Do you know what it is with some youths? Yeah, they think, oh, this, this is just the older. There's loads of us, yeah. And uh, one of them will probably be game and all the mates will shit themselves. Once you slap the main one who's giving it all the lip, rest of them shit themselves. Like, every time. But yeah, it's crazy. Bro, I'm 36. Any one of these teens will smash me right now you know what it is bro I always feel like but sometimes yeah they come in groups don't they like if there's loads of them obviously 16 year old they, just may, they may as well be an adult or something because when I was I ain't grown since I was 16 I've been about 5 foot 8 or 9 since I was 16 and uh, all it takes is loads of them if you know what I mean but yeah, a lot of them are just tricks. The, the younger generation these days are just mad. 
every time I walk into town, bro, people just are either looking at you, giving you dirty looks, or yeah, just wanting to beef you. Well, me, I just want to chill, make my music, and uh, get stoned. You know what it is, bro. When is the, re the remix of Anissa Stay Over coming out? Lad. You know where it is? I'm dropping a lot of house music. I've got loads of stuff scheduled. But yeah, you've suggested that, so I'm going to drop that 100%. I've got a lot of remixes coming out. And a lot of uh, original stuff with uh, people what sung over my house beats as well. So yeah, look out for that, bro. It was one of your mixes, I think. Yeah, man, uh, yeah, I'll definitely drop that. It's on Spotify, I think, but uh, I, I need to drop it on my YouTube as well, really. 100%. Right, I'm, I just need to put... No, actually, I, we're going to put my phone on there and have a piss in this corner, but there's too many people around me. And it stinks a piss round here, so I think this is where everybody goes for a piss and it's getting to my head. Afterlife is a slapper of tune. Yeah, man, my G, mad respect, bro. Mad respect for locking in, bro, because uh, my house, I only started releasing house music last year. And uh, a lot of people have been tuning in lately. And my grime music, I make it for my, like, uh... Like, I only make grime music really for the people what have been around for, like, on my channel for time. And, like, even people what just subscribe, like, recently for grime. So, just house music and grime, that's probably, probably my genres now. I hope grime music makes a comeback though as well, because grime, man, that's one what I grew up on, grime. But yeah, I might jump back on live stream in a minute. I literally generally need to go for a piss. And I don't want to get cancelled in case, you know what? Do you know what? And uh, uh, Rory Fleming, mad respect to you as well for locking into house music, man. Big ups to you both. Have a good Saturday night. I'm literally too waved. I'm probably going to go home and get a munch and go to sleep. But yeah, peace both of you, yeah? Like, mad respect. Safe. 